Hey guys, so here is part two of my skirt collection. Um, if you didn't see part one, go check it out. It does have a few different mini skirts in it and different colors than the skirts I have here. So without further ado, here is skirt number one. This one actually did come with a belt and I don't remember what I did with it. But the loops are not fake. I can actually put a belt with it, which is very nice. And I bet you guys are all thinking this is going to be a longer skirt. Just you wait. And just like with the first video with the skirts, the other two skirts with zippers, this one's zipper gets stuck when switching between the pleated section and the not pleated area. So it's a little bit of a pain to get up. So like I said, the zipper gets stuck right here. So I got some assistance. But otherwise, as you can see, it is not a long skirt. It's also not even a skirt. It is a squirt. So, <laughs> it's even more secure. It is a high rise skirt though, so it comes all the way up to my belly button. And this is what this one looks like. It's red, blue, it's like a brownish skirt when you mix the colors together. That's kind of what it looks like. Alright, so the next skirt, I told you in the last video that I did have skirts with color and I proved it with a yellow one. This one is my pink one. It is a pink mini skirt. And this one is also the same fabric as the yellow one. It's a, a more spandex fabric. So this pink one actually does have pink in it. It's red, pink, and black. So this is what that one looks like. And it does pass the twirl test. So, what do you think about the pink one on me? Huh? Looks good. Alright, so the next one is not a mini skirt. It is, I told you I had some green ones. This one's green and dark blue with like a beigey white. And it's of the same kind as the last longer skirts I had in the last video, the other video. I feel like I'm saying last too much. Last and next, but it's very hard not to say them. So here's this one. This one goes, well, I have a different band shirt that has green in it, and that's one I tend to wear, the shirt that I tend to wear with this one. It does have the little underskirt. And then, let's see, my next one is a Halloween colored one. It's purple and green. I actually forgot about this one. That's perfect for the season. I totally need to get more clothes that are like holiday seasonal so that I can have my Halloween clothes. My Christmas clothes. I got Christmas underwear. 
I just need clothes to match it that are not pajamas and not little kiddish. Alright, so here is my purple one. And then I have two more after this one. The next one is dark blue, like midnight blue, something like that. Uh, and green. It's not a mini skirt, it's a longer one. And again, I love these skirts because then I can wear them. Well, first of all, I can wear them in different styles because there's some where you wear them, you know, like real high. And then they make it a mini skirt. And then I can have it longer for winter. But here's what this one looks like. To me on the camera, it just looks like really dark plaid. And my last skirt, it's more of a plain Jane skirt. It is just a black one. But I love it and it's probably my most worn skirt because it is just plain black so it goes with anything. So here is this one, and like I said, I do wear it with just about anything. This one's not a Twirl Test really approved one, but it's still cute and movable. So that is the end of my skirt collection. I don't have two horribly mini skirts, um, but I'll probably get more. Um, yeah, if you like this video. Make sure you hit uh, the thumbs up. If you want to see more collection videos or any of the other videos, get notifications. Make sure you subscribe and hit the bell. Um, we do have the my uh, panty collection and Courtney's panty collection. Both of them are uncensored and they're on Patreon. They're under the five dollar tier, which the link is below. Otherwise, that's it for now. Bye!